There are so many avenues to explore and stories to tell. It's just about finding new ways of telling them. I didn't grow up listening to the Smiths, but now I am a fan. I love his music and listen to so much of it for the film. It's not a regular biopic. They picked a part of his life that people don't really know about. You learn what informs his lyric. I grew up on stages. Not standing outside the Royal Court Theatre wistfully, but with enthusiastic people from the community. The passing bells highlights the horror of the fighting from both sides and draws parallels between these two young boys' lives. I grew up on the stage, and there's no two ways about it. You only get one chance to do your bit. I was actually deputy head boy at my school. And everyone around me was very supportive of what I wanted to do. There's no romantic story about how me and my brother got to where we are. There are such strong women in my life that there's no chance of me getting too big for my boots. I'm not running about playing romantic leads. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, but it's the way it's sort of working out. I do constantly get to change the way I look, which is sort of an old school idea of acting. Everybody knows the story of the Smiths. You can still go and see Morrissey. I had the benefit of there being no stigma attached to the arts. My brother's a ballet dancer, and he never came up against anything. Learning how to put someone in an arm lock without breaking their arm. It's quite handy isn't it? If you speak to any soldier, even now, they say they are fighting for their friends. It always ends up that they're fighting for the man next to them. Our parents were just brilliant parents who encouraged us to do whatever we wanted to do. I've no idea if I want to do this for the rest of my life, so I want to try and work with the best people I can. I want to play in as many theaters as possible, work with as many brilliant people as possible, but definitely do a new play. One trap you can fall into when playing someone iconic is to end up doing everything in an iconic way, no matter how pedestrian or mundane that thing is. I had an unhealthy obsession with only fools and horses. I still have to watch an episode with my brother every two or three weeks. Since I was 21, I have not been able to sleep past 9am, I just want to get up and do something. 